Hi guys on YouTube, it's Super Canutter here. Uh, just a quick video I thought I would make today. Um, this is about E3 being cancelled. Um, basically E3 2023 is being cancelled. And my thoughts on this. What really I don't get is, why are people so bothered that it's been cancelled? E3 has been downhill for years now. And it's no surprise that it was going to be cancelled because no company really wants to go anymore. It's basically, it's old. It's had its time and it does not need to be around anymore. I know some people are really like, oh, but it's tradition. Every um, June we have E3, you know, gaming's ruined. No, it's not. Because E3's gone doesn't mean gaming's over. It's just an event. It's not like back in, like, let's say mid 2000s when, you know, internet was, yeah, we had the internet and all that, but people weren't used, were just using it more like using it on MySpace. YouTube was getting around places. But there you would want E3 because then you would read journalists of what, you know, you read journalists and see what they've said about E3 and what's coming out. That was great. But now we have the internet. We have live streaming. We have all these new platforms to watch like events like this now. We don't need E3. And honestly, E3 sucks. Well, not, not recently. I mean, not in the past. E3 was great. But ever since Nintendo went and decided to make their own directs, it just went downhill. It started to suck. And you know. This is what. So this is the time when E3 went down. It wasn't because of Covid. That didn't kill E3. Nintendo making their own directs. Started to kill E3. Because. Nintendo found it was cheaper. To do their own thing. Rather than get a venue at E3. Which will cost them money. So it's easier for them. Just to do their own thing. Put it on a live streaming uh, platform like Twitch or YouTube. And, you know, you've got it. They don't have to pay for anything else. They've got all the resources they need. So it was cheaper. And then, a couple of years later, Sony went the same way. Um, with their own directs. I can't remember what they call it now. They're, um, I just call them PlayStation directs. I, I can't remember what they actually call them. But they started doing it. Because, again, they saw, they saw it was cheaper to do this than rather go to E3. And then, ever since then, it started going down. Companies just didn't really want to do that. There is, like, they found out it was cheaper just to do a live stream than pay for a venue at E3. So, yeah, that's the reason why e is dead. And people are, like, wondering, oh, will E3 happen next year? Because the... Um, coordinators for E3 said E3 they will still try and do one in the future just give up no one really is bothered about E3 anymore it's like I said it's not like back when we were young and that we had gaming journalists going there to tell us what we had to look at we can see it now we can actually just watch the stuff these days we don't need to go there we don't need to just Wait for a live stream of theirs to do like to know what's going on. It's just in like it's basically just live streaming on their own now. It's easier. And I think obviously Nintendo, Sony, Microsoft are gonna do their own thing in June for like a somewhat E3 event. You know, it's easier for them to do that, and I think that that's what's gonna happen. Same with like Sega, Ubisoft, Konami, I think all the companies are going to do stuff like that anyway so it's not a big deal just let e3 rest in peace it's dead and get over it it's just not it's not a big thing anymore and i'm sorry to say that because i did enjoy e3 but you gotta know when to stop beating that dead horse and this is the time you gotta think about it it's gotta stop and e 3 is just not the same anymore. Ugh. I just had to say that, guys. It's just not going to work out anymore. 
it really is not so let it die and just enjoy other things like the golden joystick rewards the game awards um and all that just enjoy that instead and you know look forward to that instead that's it nothing more to say there really um again though like just accept the fact that e3 is dead it's dead it's not it's not going to make a recovery i don't think so anyway if it does great if if it can do that but i doubt it's gonna so yeah that's all i had to say today um again give me your comments down below to see what you think um i'm happy to read your comments and see what you guys think anyway this is super Kanata, sign out have a nice day guys take care